Oh, shit. Oh, boy. Oh, god damn. You, you know what this fuck-ass logo means. Yeah. You, you've seen these things before. Oh, wait, it's not even done yet. Oh, yeah, it's time. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, it is finally time for the playthrough of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutants in Manhattan. Oh wait, that's uh, that, that's not that's not a turtle shell. Uh, we we may have some issues going on right now. Uh, technical difficulties. Let's see, what game is this? I don't know actually. I don't think I've ever. Oh, Transformers. Really? Ooh. Oh wait, wait, wait. Oh, hold on, hold on. What's this game called again? Transformers Yeah, we're doing it. We're doing it. What's going on, everybody? My name is Mash TSB. Welcome to the Fun House. Welcome to the best game ever made. Bar none. This is Transformers Devastation. Whew. Whew. All right. Oh, lordy, lordy, lord. <sighs> so, you may be thinking, what is this? Why, why is this a new save file? This is not prime difficulty or anything like that. No. This is going to be a different type of playthrough than what the uh, DMC4 LDK one was. This is going to be done new game on Commander with a handful of restrictions that we'll see uh, by the time we hit our first arc stop. So about 30 minutes in, probably by the end of the first episode, I'll explain what the restrictions are and all that happy horse shit. Ooh! God damn. Video games. So... I would like to start out with a handful of oh God. They're the boys, the, the squad, the goon squad. Oh, it's, it's not. Oh, look at the. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah, <laughs> he's not even in a mode. He's just a dude. He's just a dude, and he's flying. Ah, oh, so sick. What a video game. I I love this video game so much. Which is weird, because I. Fucking, I, I am not a Transformers fan, really, in any way, shape, or form. Um, I never watched the movies, or, um, the animated series, any of the animated series is, is actually. I think one of them I saw had, like, a little girl, and I, I just remember one episode with, like, a, 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 like, a robot, I don't know if it was, like, Autobot or Decepticon, she got trapped on this fucking planet, right? She goes into this cave, and, like, she has this whack lighter. I, I, I want to say it was a lighter for some reason, because that's how that scene usually works. She lights up the cave, and she's just surrounded by, like, alien spiders or some shit. And that's how she turns into the Autobot who's, like... Like, I think her name was, like, Black Arachne or some shit like that. I don't know, but who cares? The boys! The other squad! <laughs> It's time to roll the fuck out. So I need to roll the fuck down, if you know what I'm saying. Ugh, safe sex is important, children. Transformers devastation. Ooh! <laughs> oh, it's so good! Alright. So, uh, yeah. I, I'm, I didn't know shit about these guys. I didn't even know who, who, who like, uh, Wheeljack or Sideswipe were before I played this game. Uh, it's cool. It's fucking really sick. I started actually looking into the lore of Transformers. <laughs> this shit is retarded. In a really good way. <laughs> and actually, uh... Oh my god. Mmm. These cutscenes. <laughs> I just saw something that I don't normally see. Um... Yeah. <laughs> we'll talk about that a little bit later on. But, uh, yeah. So, we'll just sort of be going through things as they are. We'll watch some cutscenes, we'll have some fun, because the cutscenes are, are pretty um, undermade. I, I think that's actually a pretty good way to, to, to phrase it. They don't have a lot of money put into them, at least not as much as you would expect from like... Wait, can I hit it? Nope, whiff. Nope. Nope. Fuck. I'm gonna hit it. I whiffed before, I will not whiff again. There we go. God bless. Third-person shooter skills with stick. 
not exactly all there, but you know how it goes. So, what was I on about before? Yeah, the cutscenes, like, cutscenes like this are perfectly fine, but there are a couple of scenes, or moments in scenes that look very jank. Like, almost Sonic Boom tier rough. So, well, I'll point those out as they come, but uh, anyway, we, we, got a, we got a first encounter. All right. Yeah, all three of them down in one throw. Yeah, we got routing. We got strategery. We got it all. Ooh, we got spins. We spinning on them. Ooh, we spinning on them again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this game is so satisfying. I'm coming in from downtown. Urgh. Yeah. Oh, get out of my way. Oh, wait. It's the scoops. We got scoops! That was not intentional. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, no! Oh, so sick. So simple. So good. Oh, God. Strong impressions. That, that's all I can say. It, it, oh, this game feels so goddamn nice. So good. So, I'll, I'll point out those moments as they come. We have one coming up in a few scenes, I believe. But, for now, you can just sort of enjoy the, uh, the fun. Hang on, wait for it. Scoops! Midair scoops! Ooh, spin on them! Spin on them, Optimus! Show them why they call you Prime! Ooh, coming in hot! Wait for it! Ooh, success! Cause they knew it was sick! Shoot guns! Run into them with the car! With the truck! Ooh! Oh wait, it's not even done yet. I'm, I'm picking up a car, I'm picking up a vehicle. I'm picking up one of my brethren. Oh wait, no, 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 it doesn't work. Ah! Oh, Optimus. Uh, that that could have ended in an SS if I got it a little bit earlier, but you know how it do. Oh, that was so good. Ugh. Right. God, it's so fucking good. If you have not played this game and you are watching this, even worse, if you are watching this, have not played this game, and I've gifted this game to you, bloody biscuits, this is not a substitute. Mm -mm, this, this is supplementary reading. That's what this shit is. This is this, this is Cliff's Notes. You gotta read the fucking book. It's really good. It's a great book. You'd love it. I swear. I promise. Would I lie to you? Think about that for a minute. Would I lie? No. The answer is no. Cue all the instances where I have lied in a video before. Anyway, we're not talking about that. We're talking about uh, breaking down trees because they have money in them. Don't ask me how that works. We're talking about uh, destruction of infrastructure, the roads that your taxes pay for because they have money in them. Breaking cars because you just fucking gotta break shit, dude. God, dude, just devastate shit, man. Fuck. Good game. Golly. All right, we're, we're coming up on one of the lads right now, actually. We're coming up on THE boy. THE guy. Look at him, he's stomping, he's like, ah, oh, why am I so good? That's what he's thinking to himself. Fuck, why am I so sick? <laughs> uh, I don't know, he actually needs help breaking this down. So, um, in this section, we can see how Transformers Devastation is actually teaching you the intricacies of the focus mechanic through naturally through play. Fucking kill me, dude. Oh, oh, ch sick. It's not even done yet. Oh, give me, give me that vehicle attack. I'll oh, run my car body into him. Kick him, kick him, shoot him, and then run into him again. Yeah. Uh, get, get his boyfriend. Get, yeah, get the boys. Grenade launchers. Other things. Ooh, ooh, spin on him, Optimus. <laughs> Oh, wait, here we go, here we go. Oh, I'm charging it. Ooh! What the fuck even happened there? So there, there are times in this game where, uh, simply put, I, I will dodge things, even on this difficulty. I will dodge things, and I will get focus time, and I will have no idea where the hell I get my focus trigger from. No clue. That is entirely a fault of my own inexperience with this game. But uh, speaking of an experience, uh, you're gonna you're gonna see me do something that, that might not make sense here in a second, but believe me, it, it works. So while this cutscene is happening, I do want to give shoutouts to a couple of uh, YouTubers out there or content or game players who have made the uh, 
basically a lot of the meta for what goes into Devastation play right now. Those people are sorry and Dash. This dude has mad tutorials for all sorts of Platinum games, plays a bunch of different stuff. He's been doing this for years. Recommended highly that you go check him out. Sorry and underscore Dash. There's Details Gaming spelled D-E-T-A-L-Y... Z, it's it's spelled wacky, but gaming is the same, I swear. And then, last but not least, the boy who came out with a really strong VST9 entry. Who could forget? With your boy, John Chin. Jonathan Chin. Okay, I thought I was going to take damage there somehow. So... Yeah, go go check out all those guys. I'll I'll probably have links to their uh, their content in the description of this video, and and hopefully I will remember to do so for the other videos in this series, because they it's a little bit less details gaming, but Sarian and John Shin especially. I can't believe I took that hit. I am so upset I took that hit. I dodged that perfectly the last time I did this. Fuck. Whatever. Not a big deal. Shit happens, ladies and gentlemen. Shit happens. That's that's the lesson. <laughs> oh, I was about to get exposed. I was about to get fucking exposed. <laughs> live on air. Have to do a live cut. I swear to God, that's what is about to happen to me. But, you know, alas. No, fuck you. Fuck you, Devastator. You bitch. You bitch that I'll fight like 12 goddamn times this playthrough. Check this shit. Dropkick! Explosion! Run the car into him! Pull the car around, Optimus! Bring the truck around, we gotta get these kids to bed. Oh, shoot him! Scoops! Oh, I'm about to take damage. Yep, big damage. So, because I don't have still safe on, um, there are a couple of instances where, I, I mean, I could have theoretically done something there to stay safe, but, um, in a lot of cases, I'll be caught in the recovery time of something, and I'll just get my shit wrecked in. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. Hit this. Hit this. Charge up the fist. Ooh, run it into the ground. He didn't even react to it. He was like, fuck, that was so good. His head hurts because it was so fucking sick. Oh, he tries to stomp him out, but it just gets denied. Story at 11. Ooh. Ooh. Dodge on him. Press that R1 button with such... With such conviction. Flash on him. Energy out. You're never out of energy. Ooh, I didn't even know to dodge there. I just pressed the button. Yeah, hey, uh, I might be in a bit of danger here. Hit this. Alright. Is this gonna be sick? No. But this is! Ugh. Oh, shit. <laughs> Thank God that's over. Jeez. Oh, now, now that the dark time, the, the bad boss is over. Jesus, fuck. I have been walled at that fight so many times before, but not today. Not today, I say. I was sick. Just a couple hits take. Whatever, you, whatever you're gonna fucking do, you know what I'm saying? You, you know you gotta roll with the punches. You gotta roll with the. You, speaking of punches, I that that was a punch. Shouldn't shouldn't have rolled with that punch. Just oh god, I'm taking punches left and right. Holy shit! What the fuck happened to Vash TSB? I'll tell you what happened. He's gonna get that. No, he's not. He's gonna whiff. Vanquish playthrough a uh, fucking coming never. But you know it's coming soon? Like really fucking soon. <laughs> like scarily soon as of the time of this recording. I'll give you two words. Near automata. As uh today is uh Valentine's Day, 14th of February, with the actual release date for Japan coming, uh, fucking the 23rd. Holy fuck. Nine days. Nine goddamn days away from today. I will be playing near Automata. I can't believe it, dude. I am so horrified. Uh, but I'm also really excited. This game, near Automata's, is entering, like, legendary status. Like, you don't, you, like, don't hear about games that just 
have as much promise as this guy. Speaking of promise, I promise you I am going to fight this optional encounter. I, I, scout's honor, see? You, you can see. Uh, I, I promise that I will fight him. I will not just take the money and run, oh, uh, fuck. God damn it. I promise I won't just take the money and run away. I, I, I would never want to do that. You know, that, that, that could be a bad thing to do. Jeez, speaking of bad things to do, fucking Megatron, the Megs, the big dude, Swole McGroll. I'm gonna be fighting him like three or four times this fucking video, this session. Fuck. A million. I gotta fight a million Megatrons. All of them are assholes. I don't know, this fight's... I'm not gonna say it's been optimized, but fuck, I, I have a much better grasp of it than if I didn't practice this mission at all. But yeah, fucking Automata... Like, just think about this. Fucking news keeps coming out for the game. That's so, like... And the news isn't... Like, it's it's news. It's new shit. Just, like, over the past, like, handful of days, we've heard shit about a new body retrieval system, which plays into, like, punishments for death and shit. And then we have confirmation for super bosses. Well, I'm about to confirm, though, is that I'm about to Tatsu this boy. Oh, it's not even done. Confirm. Confirm the tutorial. Keep the Tatsu going. Punch nothing, but still get it. Ooh, and I... Ooh, I'm gonna climb over him. I'm gonna launch him in the air. Ugh. He's gonna do that. And I got the sick follow-up. Another Tatsu. Even more gunshots. Ooh, and I'm gonna run into him with my car body. And I'm gonna uppercut him. Yeah, get another one. Oh my god, Megatron. Ah, oh, fuck, he would too, you shitter. I'm gonna spin on you. Hurricane kick. Guns. Into hurricane kick rush attack. I don't even have that move unlocked. I don't need to. Fucking glitches. That's actually a glitch, by the way. Uh, there are ways to sort of cheat yourself into having a rush combo unlocked. And one of those ways is to fall with Bumblebee. It's like a Bumblebee exclusive thing. Is to gun offset. Hold on. Gotta do this again. There we go. Is to gun offset out of pretty much uh, anything. And, uh... Hold on. Hold on. I'm thinking. I I'm still processing things. Okay. 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 Hold on, wait. Spin on him. Spin on him a little bit. Hit him up with the good shit. Oh! Oh, it's not even done yet! Oh, shit, I... I would whiff. Thank you. Fuck you, Megatron. You're such a bitch. You're such a bitch. Uppercut this dude. Shoot him in the air. Don't even stop shooting him. Get run get that off fucking nothing. Off nothing. It's insanity. Hit this. Uh, it, not even done. Ooh, the back. It's a Give me that SS rank. Yeah. I fucking earned that shit. <laughs> um You'll see a couple of times where you're like, I don't know, was that, was that really, was that performance really worth the grade he got? I feel like that every time I boot up this goddamn game, I swear. But hey, that's, that's just how Devastation wants to be played. That's all I'm saying. But yeah, fucking, uh, so for those of you who have not heard the news, here's basically what's going on in Nier Automata. Starting off, most interestingly, with the body retrieval system. So when you die, uh, it's, it's not like your traditional game over. Uh, instead, since 2B is a robot, and her, like, consciousness and all that sweet shit is a microchip, they put that microchip into a new version of 2B. Huh. Wacky. But what happens to the old body? Well, let me tell you. So you find it. It's just laying there, probably, uh, probably reamed, completely and utterly wrecked. But that's okay. Because when you find it, you can repair it if you so choose. Uh, or you can salvage it for parts. And what's really interesting is that if you choose to repair it, you can fail. I don't know how you fail repairing it, but if you do, the, uh, the, the old 2B body becomes hostile, and you fight that shit. 
Like it's a mirror boss. Like, oh, fucking, I hope it's an actual boss. That's all I hope. I want it to be like a thing that has a big health bar and like is a unique enemy type that has like, that doesn't have AI on par with like the, uh, the medium bipods or whatever, the regular punching enemies. I want that shit to be like an aggressive. I basically want it to be on par with the uh, the Autobot enemies in this game. Or John. John's a really good uh, example of a. Uh, you know, it's a really good example. Here's a good example of me f just stabbing him up. Get this tutorial out of here. I know how to play this character. Shoot him, and then follow up with the goods. Ooh, 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 ooh. This boy's going down. Oh, and your friend. Ooh, the, the big rush. Just shoot him. Shoot him because I'm getting it all back. It's actually okay if I use that there just because I, I get it all back. Literally in... in, in uh, he's... Okay, he's dead. So I'm about to get it all back. Sideswipe. Now. Throw everything you've got at them. I, I will opt. We're, we're, we're gonna get me up to side swipe prime. Uh, I believe in me. Ooh, ooh, put me in range of him. Put me in range of him. I don't even care. Fucking launcher. Spicy. Ooh. Ooh, I don't even know what I just did. I, like, ooh, I don't even know how that triggered fucking witch time. It doesn't even matter. Hit him. Hit him with the good shit. My word! Ooh, sp ooh! Ooh, hold on. Wait, I'm gonna help out my boy Optimus. Yeah, run into him, Optimus! Go for it! It's not even done yet. Oh. Hold on, wait. Ooh. Ooh. I'm spinning off you, and then I'm coming for you. Oh, wait! Oh, no, I've- Yeah, Optimus! <laughs> That is like one of five times when when an AI partner will actually be helpful in a sick way. Um, but yeah, dude, fucking near automata, dude. The way this like, I have a game theory, and things like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, uh, mutants in uh, really bad games, have done wonders to just crush the confidence I have inherently in any project I think should be good. So. The law basically goes, if I like the game, it's going to be a huge disappointment. Um, or or I, I should clarify and say, if I like the game before it comes out, it's going to be a huge disappointment. Just 100%. This has happened with so many fucking games, and it, it's it's just the law. But fucking... I I don't know, dude. Nier, Nier's in a weird spot. I played Nier before it came out. And... Shush, it's it's good. The demo was so solid. Oh, fuck, you guys know you all played it. I hope. Unless you have a PlayStation... Unless you don't have a PlayStation 4, in which case, uh... I mean, yeah, console's kind of garbage. <laughs> so, like, I can't really blame you. Um, but yeah, man, this, like... Fucking... Uh, if, if Automata comes out and it's good, then new lore... The, the curse is broken, basically, is, is what I'm suggesting. That's that's entirely my point, is if, if Automata's good, then there is no curse. Vash TSB does not make games bad simply by virtue of liking them. Oh, wait, oh, side, oh, side swipe! Ladies and gentlemen, my god! Fucking get this madman out of here. Oh, it's not even done yet, I gotta roll up on some boys. Some shoot boys. Alright. Oh, come on, dude. There we go. There you go. And now we got the last round. The last stop. Oh, shit. I, I, I'm actually, like, sort of thinking about what I'm about to do next, and that should not be the way this works. Hit this. Oh, come on, dude. Ooh, that was... I, I turned hard into the damage. I didn't take any, though. Because this game is sick. Oh, it's not even done yet. Get out of here. Leave, nerd. Get a fucking job. 
Oh my god, there's a dude behind me. Oh, did it respawn? Yeah, it did. Uh, this, the fucking, the fuck. Oh, come on, dude. Really? This is how you're gonna do me? And he's, he's that way. Oh, this is the worst timeline. Fuck. So, what happened is, um, he, he, he despawned because I knocked him off the ledge. And when he respawned, he went up there. Um, and he doesn't take as much damage as, like, the sniper perched enemies do. So, I just got fu And I missed the goal ring? Oh! Oh! I deserve that A rank. That was terrible. Fuck. That was bad. But yeah, dude, I fucking... Oh, if... Like I said, Automata comes out, and it's good. The TSB curse, that shit's gone. I don't... I don't know who I pissed off to get the curse, but the curse is, is non-existent after that point in time. Check this shit out, by the way. What the fuck? What the fuck was that? That was meant to be a fucking heavy charge. Are you kidding me? Leave me alone. Oh my god. I... I hate this. I hate trying to break the shield in a stylish way. Dude, I didn't even want to target you. God damn it. This video game. Hit the- Dude! dude! Sideswipe! I just give up completely anymore. Hit this. Get out- Get a fucking job, dude. Jeez. That's what that attack should say. Just Instead of vehicle attack, fucking dude gets a job. And just flying very far away. Ooh, hit this. Ooh, hit this with my car body. Ooh. Shoot him. Scoops. And then slide over to the boy. How could this happen to you? Easily. Oh, wow. Okay. I'll take that. That was kind of sick. I like that little arc it did there at the end. Okay. What was I on about? Ugh. Oh, dude, I... <laughs> I, I know what I know what I was on about how fucking worried I am about games coming out now, dude. Um, so he, here's a very horrifying thought I had a while ago, and ever since I had it, I can't really let it go. Like, all the games I'm super excited for are are, are either going to be announced or are coming out soon, and, and, and like. I'm not just really talking about Nier, although that, that does, like, horrify me. Like, if that game is bad somehow, I will be... I will be crushed. There, there is no if and or but there. I will just be sad. But Nier is in nine days. Um, it's Suno. His fucking secret project is still out there. Somewhere in the fucking wind. I don't really know where. Um, I know where I am, though. In them fucking robo-guts. Oh, god damn it. I, I would miss the opportunity. What the fuck? I will fucking murder you. No. No, I, I disagree, actually. I'm gonna stab you. And then I'm gonna run my fucking world into you. Hit this. Go. G get knocked up. It's not even done yet. You're like, oh, this is already terrible. It's alright. Oh, you came up to me? Oh, wait. Oh, God, I'm taking damage. I'm taking damage left and right here. Hit this. Get the pause combos. Ooh! Hit him again with the same shit. They don't learn. They don't learn in these streets. That's why I gotta fucking run into him. Oh, I, I missed the plane. Shit. That was... That was embarrassing. What the fuck? Oh, what the fuck? I'm taking bullets. I'm taking mad bullets at the moment. Jeez, bro. Hit this. Super good. Super good. Where am I? I can tell you where I am right on top of this dude. Ooh, hit him with the cross swords. And then... Oof, just burn him. Just burn him to a crisp. Come on, Moon Sushi. In the building. Pick that up in the middle of a combo. Oh, God. When is fucking... St when is acquisition of items and lore being put into V-Style. Let, let's be real. The one... the one... Oh, fuck. When's taking damage being added? When's Blowhard coming back? <laughs> oh, jeez. Shade. Shade. It's a good thing I'm here, so I can just go... I, I can spin right into all the shade that's being thrown. <laughs> but, um... 
Was I? Oh yeah, it's Suno's project. That's coming out soon. He said. He said, on Twitter, "Hello everybody. I will work hard to announce my new project this year. This year, 2017. Ow, my fucking hand. 2017, dude. That's that's not far away. That is that is current year. Current year. It's Suno is gonna come out with some fire. And in light of recent events." Oh, I am inclined to believe that it will probably be a Devil May Cry game. Or it could be something completely different. I don't know. But if if it's DMC, guess what? I'm I'm nervous as shit. It's like I'm I'm worried no matter what happens next. I I'm terrified. I'm I'm a scared little baby boy is is what I'm saying. I'm not going to reach. But with this, I will. Ugh. Oh, I'm, I'm coming. I'm coming back into the, into it. All right, we're good. Nope. Got to do some funky stuff to get through those those little wind tunnels there. It can be a little bit annoying. Oh God, please don't shoot me from the back. If you, it, what the fuck? How much? How long do I have to drive to hit this? There. Go. Give me. No, I, I took damage. Give me my money so I can leave. Jesus. Just put me into this goddamn fight with Car Megatron. Fuck. <coughs> oh, sorry about that. But uh Yeah, that'll that'll be a little bit scary if that uh, gets confirmed. I'll be hype as shit when it comes out, but like here's how my mind works. Something gets announced and then I'm super excited just that the thought of it existing like it, it it's it's better than getting confirmed for... I, I don't even know. It, it's the best day ever. Like, I, I I would be fucking screaming and just joy, happiness. Happiness of the emotion would be me. And then I would sit there and I would think about it for a little bit and, I, and then I get a little bit worried. And, and then it'd be like, oh, but what if it's bad? What if, what if it isn't so hot? Just like, this drop kick! Oh, get back! Yeah. So this uh, this car chase sequence uh, is I'm gonna extend it for as long as I can because every time you may have already noticed it, whenever I hit him, I kind of get some uh, some something of monetary value out of it. So uh, hold on. So by just staying on top of him. I get him to drop weapons for me. And if I can keep him, you know, somewhat consistently uh, looped, then I can just a little bit, just by virtue of using uh, side swipes. Get the fuck back here, Megatron. You're not fucking running from me. Vehicle ability, which is the leap, which actually has an offset mechanic built into it. I can. Oh shit. This is the part where I will actually lose track of him. Fuck. God damn it. So, if for whatever reason, is he going to go to the exit? Yes, he will. Okay, so that was a, a relatively fast uh, Megatron. Yeah, he's, he's untargetable from here. Um, I got some decent... I actually got, like, I counted two or three rare drops out of that. That's really not bad for that segment. That's pretty good. Um, and also, in speaking in other things that kind of worry me... This fight. Hold on, check this. Check this setup. This setup. Uh, offset. Jump cancel it. Kick him. Ooh! 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 Setups! That was so good! Ah, I'm not even mad. He broke it. I don't even care. It's working. The strategery. It's good. Yeah! I'm taking damage too! <laughs> Ooh! Ooh! Oh boy, it's not even done yet. Ooh, get in that fucking electrical fence, dude. Get in Trump's wall, dog. You gotta go back. No, 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 no. You gotta go back. It's not even done. Ugh, anti-immigration reform in there. No, dodge it in midair. What, what's he gonna do next? He, ooh, the cross swords. Side swipe him and just let him go. Why? Because we're kicking him. Oh, the se Ooh, it's not even done. I'm not even mad! Get him! Ooh! 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 <laughs> it has never gone this well! This strategy has never gone this well! <laughs> Ooh, your 
pure junk, he says. As I fucking... Oh my god, I got kicked. Ooh! This fight is a bit of a back and forth. It's not even done yet. Oh, I'm not scared of him, though. Immigration! You gotta go! You gotta go back! You gotta go back, Megatron! Ugh. Set him up again. Just set him up again. Oh my god. Alright, we're good, we're good. I'm setting him up for the final takedown. This is it. Hit this. Oh, what the fuck? No! Wait. What? What happened? What? <laughs> Did that just happen? Did I... What happened? I w what happened? <laughs> Am I gonna die? What the fuck was that? Was that a fucking... Was that a fucking dango finish I just did? <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> okay. Um. Hmm. Okay. So. What. What killed him? He. I don't think that second tank shot knocks him back. The only thing that I could honestly think that happened. Was that. It, it fu- I'll take it! Yeah, that was sick! Fuck it! What was that? That was- I don't even know- he- okay. So the only way I think that that happened... Had to have been... He got hit by something, and something caused him to backdash, or, more likely was, he was already in the middle of the, uh, the fence active hitbox. And that caused him to just, like, as soon as he lost any invulnerability that he may or may not have had, he was in the hitbox, it ticked him for damage, and he died. That has to be it. That was so fucking weird. I am so happy I, I, Hold on, am I recording? Please tell me I'm recording. I had to have been recording. Hold on. Am I? Yes! That's in there! I need to- I need to review that. That was... I don't even know what the hell happened. Okay. So, like I said, by our, uh, our first arc visit... Um... By our first arc visit, I'm gonna explain to you guys the limitations that I have set on myself for the remainder of this playthrough. Number one is no items. I cannot use any items, uh, defensive, offensive, or otherwise. After this point in the playthrough, I really shouldn't need them. Um, number two is I have to switch character every mission. Or every chapter, I guess. So, like, uh, I have to pick a character and stick with them until the end of that chapter. I cannot carry that over into the next chapter. Um, I have to switch weapons that I am going to be upgrading and using at the end of every chapter. I have to change tech at the end of every chapter. The big reason why is so it sort of forces me to um, mess around with different weapon builds, different weapon combinations, get some different skills in there. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, get some different abilities and things of that nature in there. And then different characters in there as well, so I can display what different characters can do. And um, also just, you know, I don't have a straight line gradient of power. So it like the game is going to get like progressively harder from here on out. But I'm going to basically be rotating my different character... Um, stat placements from here on in. So I'm going to be at some type of disadvantage from here on out unless I get really sick RNG, which... <clears throat> oh, I'm sorry. I don't know what the fuck is wrong with me. I've been a little bit phlegmy. I'm not going to lie. Um, looking over it, it looks like I got pretty good RNG, actually, on uh, all my weapons here. 
So what I'm going to do is uh, we're going to cut it here. This is the end of uh, episode one. When we come back, I'm going to keep playing. We're going to go over the uh, the weapons that I've picked, the tech that I've picked, and the character I'm going to play, and we're going to go from there. So my name has been Vash TSB, <laughs> and I'll see you guys soon.